How is it going guys? Drew Peacock here back with another video and today we're going to the drag strip hopefully to see some real cool racing. There also is a burnout box and like a little pit that you can go and have some fun in. We will be taking the Mustang, however, I don't think we'll be racing it today. I know I need a fire jacket and I don't have one. I have the helmet, I don't have a fire jacket. So if you guys want to see me race the Mustang, let's get this video to 5,000 likes. Easy, easy peasy, 5,000 likes, and we'll take the Mustang to the drag strip. I mean, realistically, I'm probably gonna go eventually anyways. I just don't wanna have two cars that are down if I do break the Mustang because we don't have the motor for the Supra in anymore. I don't know if you guys have been keeping up with the live streams. Let me turn on the lights. But the motor for the Supra is being built. The bottom end was dropped off. The head is being rebuilt. And then my homie's just gonna assemble it for me. We're gonna drop it in and see what my setup makes. So yeah, I feel like with my luck, if I go race the Mustang today, we're gonna snap an axle or something. I think the motor and the trans would be fine. I don't trust the rear end. I think we would definitely snap an axle or worst case scenario, I could be a Mustang driver and end up in a compilation of Mustang drivers that suck at driving and I don't wanna end up like that. So we'll just wait until the Supra is good, a couple weeks, and then uh, I definitely wanna see what the Mustang can do and what numbers we can put down. Anyways, uh, let's just say someone's new to my channel and they have no idea what car I'm talking about. We're talking about my 06 Mustang GT with a built Gen 3 Coyote with a big old three liter on the top um very fun car it definitely needs better suspension but very fun car and uh it will be fun to see what this thing does at the track i wish there was a closer quarter mile track to me that sadly there's not it's only an eighth mile track and um i definitely think this car would shine at a quarter mile track just because i'm not going to try to launch it really hard just in protecting the car like i'm not trying to set a record here i'm just trying to go have some fun so i wouldn't launch it very hard and just an eighth mile, there's not enough strip to like really put the power down. Like I'm going to be in it for what? Like six seconds and then it's going to be over. So personally, I got to take this thing to a quarter mile track or even better, an airstrip. I know there's an airstrip event coming up. So maybe we'll take it to that. I also see Mammy is in the background. She will be riding with us today. Say hi, Mammy. All right. She's very shy. I, I like how she's shy. Hate comments. <laughs> yeah, all the hate comments are going to come for her. I like how she's shy in the videos, but she's not shy in the live streams. Like she's usually my camera person in the live streams and when she's in there, she's super talkative. But whenever I bust out the, the vlogging camera, she just, she just freezes up. So anyways, uh, we're going to head out. Let's get a cold start. Mammy, do you mind holding the camera? Hi guys. Welcome back to my channel. I am Drew Peacock and I like fast cars. <laughs> The car was already warmed up. I'm sorry about that. But uh, we're going to head out. Hopefully it's a good day. Oh, and of course, if we see someone along the way that wants to test the mighty three valve, we'll show them what it's got. Can't go anywhere without a little horsepower juice. Guys, let's play a game. Comment down below your credit card info and that's how much horsepower your car has. Comment down below right now. All right, we just got to the drag strip. Uh, already ran into one fan. Pleasure meeting you, buddy. Mammy somehow snoozed in the car. I don't know how she's capable of doing it, but she did it. Yeah, I really want to see what this thing does on the track, but like I said, I don't want to have two broken cars, and I am anticipating the stock axles just exploding. So when I come, we're gonna full send it, but uh, I need the, the fire jacket and space in the garage for when it breaks. Anyways, we're gonna head over to the strip. We'll start there and then we'll move over to the burnout pit. I'm going to flip the mic when we get there so you guys can hear me. You'll still be able to probably hear the cars, but um, I don't want to just record cars. I want to talk as well and place bets, you know, fictional bets, but bets. I'll bet with her and we'll see who gets uh, more right. Loser buys dinner. Also parked next to another S197. So we have two one S197s. Let's go. One thing I love about the drag strip just like it just brings out all of the coolest cars i see a fogger system in there at least that's what it looked like we got gto c5 corvette just all of the nicest cars i mean there's okay maybe not this meat there's a bunch of uh slingshots over there so maybe not this meat another three valve s197 i think this is the most three valves i've seen 
I think the one over there was a V6, but still, it's the most S197s I think we've seen. Uh, we can see a little bit more. All right, we have, uh, I can't see the left lane. We, uh, we have an Audi and a truck. All right, we, we can't place bets on this one, because... Ford Focus Turbo versus a, uh, did he say a Nissan Rover? What the hell did he say? I can't see it from here. All right, well, we didn't watch the race, but we saw something much cooler. The, the, the Range Rover won. It beat the Focus ST. Jesus. All right, we have what looks like a uh, G80 BMW versus a... I can't see what's in the right lane, but I think the BMW is going to take it. I'm betting on the BMW. I can't even see what's on the right, but I'm just assuming that this BMW is about to just molly whop his ass. Oh, never mind. It was a Mustang. Oh. oh, the BMW barely won. Barely won by like 0.1 of a second. I turned down the audio a little bit, so we'll see. Um, it looks like we have a Lexus or a Toyota in, in the right lane, and then a, I can't even see from here. We're, we're kind of far down track, so we're just gonna have to see as they fly by. Acura pulls away. Acura versus, oh, oh RSX? <laughs> The stock Accord won. I don't know if it was stock, but he pulled away. It sounded like the RSX was breaking loose. Oh my God, Mammy, look at we got the farm truck out. Giant crew cab. Hondas, dude, it's Honda night or something. It's Honda night. Pair of Audis right here. I couldn't tell you what they are from here. This guy doesn't know how to stage up. There we go. Here we go. Damn, Audis are moving. Oh my God. 7-1. Wow. That, that, that Audi was moving. That Audi was moving. Okay, I think we see a Hellcat. But I, I like seeing them fly by with speed instead of just watching the launch, you know? Here we go. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. 590, 125 mile an hour pass on an eighth mile. Oh, here's that Mustang, Mammy. Here's the Mustang. This shit sounded so sick. Gen 1 Coyote. That shit was sick. That shit was sick. I do have the mic facing backwards, so hopefully the audio sounds good. But it looks like we have a Trackhawk versus a Mazda. Let's see what happens. Here we go. I mean, I'm obviously betting Trackhawk. Oh! The FD! I thought it was going to be a Miata. Yeah, that was cool. I thought it was going to be a Miata, but that was kind of sick. Oh, well, someone jumped. Someone jumped. I don't know who it was, but it seems like someone jumped. That Trackhawk was moving, though. That Trackhawk was moving. I don't remember watching this guy race, but apparently he did. What's that in the in the left lane over there? Is that a Challenger again, or is that a... It looks like a Challenger. It looks pretty boxy. And I don't see what's on the right lane. Oh, there it is. That shit was badass. Damn! Dude. Fucking hell. Those guys are moving. Miming. Holy shit. My Mustang ain't doing no numbers like that. That's crazy. Jeep versus Fox Body. I mean, I would hope the Fox Body wins, but we've, se we've seen some funky stuff already. We've seen some real funky stuff. Here we go. Oh. Oh, the, the Fox Body's moving. 7.5 for the Fox body. Oh, is this one of the Hellcats? Bro, this guy was fucking flying. This is the one that was a 5.9. I don't think this is the one that was, uh, that just did, that just passed. This one passed a couple passes ago. Yeah. 
Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Four eight. Oh my God. Four eight. Jesus Christ. Holy shit. Oh, this is the, one of the other fast Hellcats, dude. That thing was quick. Here's the Jeep that ran it right now. Oh, he's got some big wheels and tires, bro. I should have brought the fucking uh, the canyon. I should have brought out the canyon. So that Pontiac just smacked one of the timing blocks or whatever, so they got to fix it. I mean, dude, 480? Was that what it would It did a 480, right? Yeah. Keeping that thing straight, the G-forces? Crazy. All right, looks like we got a coyote truck and I don't see anything in the other lane, so he might be racing himself. Oh, he's definitely racing himself. Six three, 112 miles per hour. It's like a track hawk killer right there. <laughs> Here we go, Firebird. Oh my God, he popped the wheelie. Camaro. Fifth generation Camaro. Oh, a fifth gen. I can't tell from here. Here we go. God damn. That motherfucker was loud. Oh, Mammy, look at this one. It's a streetcar. <laughs> Hold the parachute. He said 620. <laughs> Did I hear the announcer wrong? Did he say 126 or 626? Because it's a big difference. Mother. That shit hurt my ear. Here we go. Another uh, fox body, I think. I'm super zoomed in for you guys. So you guys might be able to see it. I can't see it. Damn. I just want you guys to hear this car over there. He's on the other track. sounds so good all right here we go we have a caddy coming in there's music playing so hopefully I don't get copyrighted for it but once he starts drifting I'm assuming we'll just mainly hear his car let's see if he's got what it takes here he comes let's see what he's got he's got aftermarket halos it's pretty quiet he's got a helmet on though so it's a good sign Is he valid? Is he valid? All right, we got some figure eight action going down. He's getting pretty close to the wall, not too close. Bang and red line. He is smacking red line. Little rollback, all right. Sorry, there's a photo shoot going down. They're kind of blocking it. All right. All right, I'll say he's valid. That was pretty valid. Here we go. BMW, it's already fucked, so maybe he'll smack another wall. I don't know. All right, so far this ain't valid. And his trunk don't look too valid either. His trunk looks like a rolled up cum rag. It's a perfect car to practice in though, I will say that. Like this is what he should be doing with it. 
They died. Car's barely running. He just has red tape as taillights. It's just red tape. All right, I don't think the car has the power. I think the car's choking. We'll blame the car. Car ain't valid. He is just smacking red line. Dude, he is just smacking red line. The truck itself is actually really clean though. I will say that the truck itself is really clean. And if I sound like I'm yelling, I'm sorry. It's so fucking loud. Between him and the music, it is loud as shit. better this time. Oh, All right, he's more valid this time, that's for sure. this whole time for a B6. So far, I'm going to say not valid. I'm going to say not valid on this one. He's doing his best, though. back by the baby v6 he can't do much better all right on that note i think it's time to leave all right guys well we're taking off right now i really want to race my car like i brought extra money just in case to just you know buy in and go ahead and race um but like i said i didn't bring my helmet i don't have my fire jacket so they wouldn't have let me they might have given me one i think there are guys here that will let you do that but i i didn't bring my helmet just so i didn't race but i <laughs> I want to so bad. So if you guys want to see me race, hit that like button. I mean, I'm going to do it anyways, eventually. So hit that like button. We'll race next time we come. Anyways, hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. The Super will be back up and running ASAP. Which one would you rather see me race first? I guess the Super or the Mustang? I kind of want to see what the Mustang does because I have ran it before on its older three valve setup. So it'd be interesting to see just how much has changed. But let me know down below, comment, subscribe, and until next video, peace. Yeah, look at the exhaust Look at them. Look at them. He has them. He has the glowing exhaust tips. He's cool. Oh my god. I never thought, I never thought I would see that in person. And here we are. What a great day. We saw fast cars. We saw ricers, or one. What a great day.